Hi, we're the Lorries, your realtors, your neighbors, your friends. Today's topic is how to prepare your home for El Nino. Hi, I'm Lori Little of the Lorries and Company, your realtors, your neighbors, your friends. Today's topic is how to prepare your home for El Nino. But before we get started, if you're looking to buy a home, please click the home search button. If you're looking to sell a home, please click the home evaluation button. Now back to our topic. So we've heard a lot of information about El Nino and how things are gonna be different this year after coming off one of the biggest droughts that we've ever had. So it's important that we all look and prepare our homes and make sure that we don't have added expenses or any surprises. So a couple things that you might wanna look at is one, fix any leaks before it actually rains. With the dry heat, it may have caused the structures to shrink and there could be potential holes where water can seep in. You may also wanna contact your roofer and have them take a look at the roof to make sure everything looks okay. Uh, second, you might wanna clean out your gutters and downspouts. It's good to look at that before the season starts as well as at the end of the season. Investing in a generator is another great idea. Just in case the power goes out, some of us live in areas where it goes out a little bit more, having that portable generator on hand is a good idea. Painting your eaves and um, making sure that they're sealed to avoid any wood dry rot and damage that way is also something that you may consider. And last, you may wanna also look at your decks and any balconies that you have and ensure that the sloping is going away from the home to avoid any flooding. Thank you again for listening and watching our video. If you have any questions regarding real estate or about this topic, the El Nino, please give us a call. Have a great day and stay safe this winter.